Hi, so we're Snap Shop. We're from all over Texas, basically. Nice. And we made an image recognition shopping helper. Cool. So, let's see it. So our basic aim was that you see stuff around you that you really like. And you see, you search for things online all the time. Why not look for things around you that you really like and be able and have the opportunity to get to know all about it in a matter of seconds. So you just take your phone. So uh, let me open the Snapshot, Snapshot app. Uh, so you take your phone and you suppose you have this, a banana, right? You wait for it to recognize. This little label up there. Yeah, it, it takes a couple of seconds. So it's a banana. Did you wish you didn't have a yellow? Oh, it, yeah. it says banana. It so says it's banana fine. there. Yeah, so suppose we it. want to order from Postmates. So what you do is you click on the Postmates delivery app, and it sends a message to the server saying that the banana will cost eight twenty-five cents and will be delivered in sixty minutes. And uh, you can talk more about that. Yeah, so there's actually a lot that goes into this tiny little pop-up, as you know. So we, we have to get, first of all, the, the banana, the fact that it's a banana. This device's current location, all the stores around you that sell bananas. Um, and then basically filter for all the ones that Postmates can actually go to, like not online, they're not too far, stuff like that, and then make the call to Postmates finally. That's cool. What did you use to find the stores, like the item search? The Goods API, found by the wonderful oh, yeah. Andrew. <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty cool API. Um, that's awesome. Yeah, uh, absolutely. So we looked at the cell phone, it's a, it's a cell phone. What if we want to search for that? So suppose we want to search for it on Amazon. So we click Amazon, and it goes to the Amazon website with a list of all the cell phones. Would it work with this watermelon? Uh, we could straight. try. Let's see. It might be more tricky, but let's see. Actually, it's done it before. Yeah, it has done it before. It's done it before, yeah. Let's see. It says toothbrush. Toothbrush. I see it. I see it. It says beverage. So that it did work. Beverage and plastic. So, which is basically the general form of the water bottle. Nice. And so it does, it's, it's good at recognition, it's better than we thought it would be. And uh, yeah, so even, even for the image recognition, we did have to parse through the, the API a little bit. Because, first of all, for most of the responses, the first response, the most confident, is usually, is usually like indoors. Because yep. it's like, if I, know, if I don't know anything else, I'm indoors for sure. Yeah, which so image recognition API did you use? Microsoft Cognitive Toolkit. Okay. Cool. So we're looking for the most relevant response from that, and then going from there. So we hit the, hit the API. Yeah, it turns to JSON, we pause to that, and look at the most relevant response. Yeah. Did you stay up all night? Yeah. Yes. yes, I have. Sleep's gonna be good tonight. I haven't slept <laughs> in 29 hours, probably. Yeah, yeah. Actually, more than that, I haven't slept since. Yes, like 7 p.m. yesterday. 7 a.m. yesterday. Wow. Awesome. Well, great job, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.